Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's video is an update on my desk setup. I really needed a minimal but functional workspace and I'm really happy with the outcome. I know it's not the best and it's not even that expensive, but honestly, it doesn't matter as long as it works. I managed to find really amazing deals, except for this monitor that you see right now that I paid full price, but it's still cheap compared to other options. This is 24 inch and it was 100 euros. To complete it, I needed a support and I decided to go for this white one because it's nice and elegant but also functional. It is an essential item to me because posture is important so it's always better to keep your computer a little bit higher. I like the fact that you can fold the sides and also I think it's really resistant. I even tried putting a lot of weight on it and it doesn't even bend so this is absolutely approved. These things were a little hard to put back in place, but it doesn't matter because they are still super useful. Next, I'm going to show you the things that I bought very quickly. We have a keyboard and a mouse, both from Logitech. I have a microphone which is the one that I'm using right now and I think the quality is good. Let me know what you guys think. Then a video capture card that can be useful if I want to record gameplays and stuff. And then we have this big headset. There's not really much to explain here since I fell in love with this keyboard the moment that I saw it because I think this lilac color with the little yellow details just make a beautiful match. It's really functional because it's super light, super comfortable and it just feels so smooth on your fingers. Also the sound that it makes, chef kiss. It works for me even though I have long nails. It's still super manageable and it can be connected to up to three devices just like the mouse. This cute thing that you see here, it's called Pop Mouse, and this is like an updated version of the first Pop Mouse that Logitech made that was like a match with the keyboard, but this is the second version. I like it because it can connect to three devices, and there's also a personalized button. I think it's to put like mm, your favorite emojis. I didn't really connect it, but you have to download the app. Moving on to the microphone, this was the best deal out of everything because I paid half of the price, which was 80 euros, I paid 40. And it is amazing because this is considered to be the best gaming microphone among the cheap options. So if you're looking for a cheap but also high quality microphone, this is the best. I have my MacBook in the background that sounds like it's about to take off because I've been editing since this morning, so it's really, really overheated, but this sound is really clean. This big headset that you see here really captured my attention because when I saw the reviews, I saw that the color was not as vibrant as the picture and it was honestly 10 times better, so I immediately bought it. I know it doesn't really match the keyboard and the mouse, but it doesn't really matter because when I turn my lights on, they just look the same. They look lilac. The quality is premium, these ears are so cute and soft, but I take them off because I don't really like them. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, I'm putting this on to show you. I've already tried it with a lot of games. The microphone is good, like it's good enough, and they're not too heavy on your head. So this were approved as well. Now let's move on to the LED lights part. I bought a just a random led strip light all i know is that i'm probably going to keep it on the purple color for like 90 percent of the time 
so this is what I did and I also bought a long socket that I'm gonna put underneath my desk I'm really lucky to have this little space that you see here uh, on the bottom right where I can put chargers and everything so you can't see that I'm not really good at cable management but it doesn't matter because I will have time eventually before moving on to the most important part of this video which is the switch unboxing and while you watch me rearrange the rest of my desk I want to share this sad story with you so because I was on a budget and I didn't want to spend like a lot of money and tried to buy everything on sale I had decided that I wanted to buy a secondhand Nintendo Switch unfortunately I gave my money to a scammer so I lost 250 euros and I'm really sad about it but I will sue him and I just hope he'll go to jail somehow. <laughs> that being said, the switch that you see here is a brand new switch. My mom helped me buy it and I'm really really grateful. I don't want to talk much because the rest of the video is kind of ASMR. So just enjoy the unboxing. I will talk to you for a final consideration. Hello, I'm back. Look at these colors, you guys. I'm really, really happy. The setup is finally complete. I know it's not perfect. It's small. This is what I have to work with. This is the space that I have. Keep watching the video because in the end, I will show you the ways that I'm using this setup right now. I'm using this as an editing space, watching anime space, and obviously gaming space. Here, I took my switch light to transfer Animal Crossing data. Speaking of which, guys stay tuned because i'll be uploading animal crossing gameplays so if you're interested subscribe to my channel 
last but not least i want to show you my gaming chair that i've been using for almost a year now and i got it on amazon i wanted an all white chair so far so good i thought that it would get dirty very easily but it doesn't <laughs> I'm 